Okay, made some changes. Not sure if I've got them. I got this 100% the way you want it, but it's probably close enough to give you an idea on cost. In my email, within the body of the email, indicates what the cost could be. Some of them are ranges. Um, and the idea would be certainly to work towards a more formal, specific cost figures. But let me run through what I have in the design. We call these stacked cabinets where there's two doors at the top, two doors at the bottom here. And I think a nice touch would have the top part or top section be glass. Doors prepared for glass. And then I've got under cabinet molding, I've got crown molding, and this crown molding would touch the ceiling. You can see that same stacked cabinet theme going across here under cabinet molding. <coughs> I didn't do it for the um, refrigerator cabinet because it looks a little odd. I've got a wall cab, an oven cabinet down here. Super Susan, cabinet with rollout trays and a drawer, dishwasher, very common 36 wide sink base, double pull out trash with a drawer, bank of four drawers, another cabinet with a drawer and a door, Super Susan again in the corner, two draw base cabinets on either side of the stove. This is 12 inch deep storage on the sitting side of the island. And then on the other side of the island, we have a bank of three drawers each. So six drawers total. We do have wainscoting on either side of the island. This is the dry bar, bank of four drawers, bank of four drawers, wine storage in the middle. Again, cabinets prepared for glass, this top section, these two doors, this top section. And this is the microwave slash coffee area. When you open these doors, these will be pocket doors and inside would be space for coffee uh, machine and then there would be adjustable shelves again these these uh, doors here these four doors would be prepared for glass uh, cabinets go to the ceiling uh, under cabinet molding cabinet with roll out trays and a drawer then there's a small drawer underneath the wall cabinet um, the microwave drawer or the microwave. I suspect that this this area would need to be modified a little bit. Um, there's some wall that is uh, that needs to be removed. I'm assuming that it's non load bearing. If that's the case then that's not a problem. I know this has been kind of a quick video, but I want to go over the pricing. If I use Starmark inset, inset doors are what you have today, where the door is flush with the face frame. And they're Nottingham door style, maple wood, painted perimeter and stained island you're looking at the cabinetry to be around between 60 and 62,000 depending on the final parts and pieces needed in your floor plan which I'm aware that I'm I'm pretty close probably to what you want exactly cabinet installation this likely 
is will be accurate uh, assuming that we're not adding too many more parts and pieces remove of the old cabinets and disposing of them including the countertop getting rid of the tile backsplash uh, the wall space around the pantry or essentially above the pantry closet um, repair the wall behind the tile backsplash because usually the wall, the sheetrock behind the tile is compromised. Give you a range there. Not sure how much it would cost to convert the two posts that are now round to a square post to give them a more modern look. I will have pricing on the countertop soon. Your plumbing and all, actually the plumbing would probably be more like this. Electrical is not super well defined, so this is quite a range. I'm assuming you want under cabinet molding, excuse me, under cabinet lighting. And you might want lighting inside these glass cabinets too, so that can certainly change the scope of the electrical. This sh is showing a pot filler so that might change the scope of the plumbing. We might have to add some additional electrical for the microwave and the coffee maker. I'm not sure what's in this wall for electrical. Probably not much. This is the closet. So like I said the electrical part is a little bit more harder to define. But this may encourage you, my initial pricing may encourage you or may discourage you from getting towards a more formal estimate.